Greetings ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Babatunde and I'm back yet again for another reaction. Today I'm going to be checking out the In God Free We Trust podcast featuring Aiza, Fatima, Vishnu, Vaka and Dante Nero. Let's go. Immigrants specifically, their point is to they, they have children to survive. There's a survival mm -hmm. thing. So all this, all the nuance of... You know, we should be inclusive. It's, look, get your education and get your education, Get make money, become a doctor, and that, that's what you're supposed to uh, do. 90% of the, the, the uh, maybe 85% 80, of the, the guys that I get on consultations for my relations is Indian dudes who can't. Get um, it up. No, <laughs> no, they, yeah, I, well, no. I don't know. I didn't ask. <laughs> okay. But but they they now they're in a social situation where they have to deal with women where it's not their mother and their father setting it up. Right. It's and now they, they got it out there and they got to yeah. hustle it up and yeah. then and then even when they, they got no like game. arrangement. Well, well, yeah. well, yeah. This is one hundred percent facts, and it doesn't just go for Indian families and Indian people. Even like African parents as well, they try to train up their children to love education, love schooling. You know what I mean? It's also about education. It's also about schooling. It's also about getting a good degree. It's also about getting a good job, a doctor, a lawyer. There's so much focus on on education. They kind of forget about the the social aspect of living life. They grow up isolated. They don't know how to talk to a girl. They don't know how to interact with females. It's not just Indians. It's immigrants in general. Immigrants from the Western world. Yeah. Hustle it up. And yeah. then and then even when they, they got no like game. the arrangements. Well, yeah. Well, yeah, it's hard. Like, they gotta have game. Gotta That's have why game. you had arrangements, because you guys was trash. Dante, no, no. <laughs> you're generalizing. No, what? you have, remember we showed the video. Hello, madam. Hello, madam. <laughs> have you but, seen but it? Have you seen it? Talking about oh, like, people that grew up. You know, that's the thing, bro. Okay, we're gonna show this shit. No, no, I was talking about like there's a difference between kids that grew up here. Versus kids that grew up in India, like nah, hell no, 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 no. There is because I've lived what. in America I'll longer you, than you, you and I'm tell telling you, you, I'll tell you what, your motherfuckers is cornballs. I'll tell you, what. I know Indian Americans you more why. than you do. No, I'm talking about the that's difference. facts. No, but you're not listening to me. I am I'm listening to you. The difference between I've kids grown up with Indians my whole life since I was two. I'm talking about the difference between kids that grew up in India versus kids that grew up in America as a minority in white schools. Because my, a lot of my... No, no, no. I agree with Vishnu. I, I personally agree with it. Maybe in America it's different, but here in the UK, I've seen Indians with gang. Not every Indian is a nerdy, dweeby guy. For Indians who were born in this country, and, and they grew up in certain areas, maybe like London, South London. I don't really think all of them are going to be this nerdy stereotype, no. And I think that has a lot to do with culture. That has a lot to do with the environment you grow up in. Say you're an Indian guy who grew up in bloody Peckham, South East London. And, you know, you had to deal with certain things, certain negative aspects of youth culture. Then naturally, you're going to speak a certain way. You're going to talk a certain way. This doesn't go for all Indians that live in Peckham, South East London. Your environment influences how you speak, how you talk, how you move, how you walk. So it makes a lot of sense. Indians that are born in India are going to be very different to Indians that are born in the UK or Indians that are born all over the Western world. Versus kids that grew up in America as a minority in white schools. Because my, a lot of my friends, when I when I I'm met talking them, about talking to women, bro. No, no, I'm, that's why that's why I'm getting there. Because when when I meet, are corny. bro, let me finish. I'll tell you. When I meet my friends in America, they don't have the social because they are always they're hiding their culture, they're hiding who they are. That's, they're they're kind of like trying to assimilate. Yes. Whereas in India, where we were. We were getting like we were educating about. But you were service. forcing women to marry your asses. Not really, no. Again, you're you're <laughs> you're. Out of here. No, not really though. Not in India. Wait, are you and saying, then you were smacking them in their that, breasts. Are not you in India. Smacky, <laughs> smacky, yeah. oh, smacky. No, that's that's, that's just. I mean, that, that's, just, <laughs> that's just generalizing, overly generalizing. But what? Yeah, because I'm not it, saying there's no Indian dudes that are smooth. No, I, mean, but, I know some Indian bro, casters. I mean, not a lot, though. When you not, not a lot. Well, again, not again, a lot. Again, and and if they are, are smooth, about... that means you've hung around okay. us. I'm telling you, Indians that are born in this country are very different. They got game, they got swag. Trust me, it's not as simple as Godfrey is laying it down. Godfrey is looking at this whole situation in a somewhat, in a somewhat simplistic way. I think it's deeper than that. Some Indians have game. They do. 
No. When you go, not at all. Well, again, not again, and, and if they are smooth, that means you've hung around okay, us. The difference. <laughs> no, no. The difference right, is. That's right. Okay, I grew up in India. I grew up in India, so I know how it are is. Are you smooth? Yeah, I'm smooth. Whoa, whoa. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yo, 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 wait. Wait, Vishnu, wait, hold on. Vishnu said, no, fuck that, I'm smooth. <laughs> yo, yo, okay, okay, wait, hold up. This but, is great. I love it. Wait, when, hold on. Vishnu! Baka, baka, baka. <laughs> so, yo. But when so, you speak in your own language, when you communicate with people in your own, like, you know, Okay, where okay, are, wait a minute, okay, there's okay. There's a different hold dynamic. Hold up, hold up. Versus now, if you're, when you're in America, it's your minority. If yeah. you're, in t you're speaking Telugu, right? Yeah. And you see a girl. <laughs> Uh, you're see, not smooth, friend. She's you're not Nala. She's not Gordon. You don't know me, though. No, 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 no. When Everybody you go, no, say. you're in Telugu, right? You're in school. Oh sit, you see God. a girl, and you see a girl, and you speak you, it in you your you language now. Hobble. So when you be like this, you, give me you be like, oh, brother, brother. I don't say nothing, bro. <laughs> I, I don't say nothing, bro. You're like bro. this. You're like this. No, no. My no, no, my no, 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 I don't you, speak, bro. Yo, I let me, let me. Let, no, no, no. That's weird. Man said he smiles. He doesn't even talk. That, damn. If that's true, man's got game, isn't it? No, a lot of guys can do that. That's for sure. I don't you, speak, bro. I yo, smile. let me, let me. Let, no, no, no. That's weird. It's like I this. Smile. That's where it starts, bro. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. wait. This motherfucker. No, he's like this. <laughs> yo, hey, hey, Vic, hey, Vishnu, you know, you smooth. Go talk to her. Okay, watch. <laughs> Excuse me, yeah. this, this gentleman sent you a drink? He's <laughs> <laughs> like this. No, you're bringing your uh, American, American what, dynamic. What would you say to a, a woman, dog? I mean, you, I know you're married. Smile, but what so. would you say in te like, tell her, what's your well, smooth well, move? Well, first thing is that it's a different, like, you know, we don't directly go approach a girl, like, you know. It's more like you, you kind of like throw a rock a, at her and she'd be like, <laughs> it's, a, "It's a small talk. You you smile, you talk, you build a relationship." Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. It, You're it's not a, it's a, making sense. How do you when you get oh, do you uh, go over in her area? What do you do? You from afar? You nah, like you this? Just where you smile. go? Whoo! No, no, it's <laughs> different. Again, again, it's a con it's a, it's. A, it's a more conservative culture, so you don't approach a girl and talk to her straight away. Like, like okay, you but here. so what Look about when you're he, when you're in America? That's right. And so, then you have to holler so at that, somebody. So that's the difference. Because I'm here's 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 what what I see more. Because I I you know the, the lion's share of my money I make on consultations with I, Indian I, dudes yeah. because they don't. Yeah. They don't have game. They don't know how to holler well, at the girls. Well, they don't know. Trash, and bro. then when they do holler, okay. it's usually a a a. a Dante needs to stress this more. I think he has stressed it, but it's not the fact that they're Indian. It's a cultural thing. Some East Asians as well might be a little bookish and might not have that much game. But again, it's cultural. Again, it was their parents just telling them to like go to cram school. There was so much emphasis on like schooling. They ended up forgetting about everything else, namely interacting with the ladies. The lion's share of my money I make on consultations with I, Indian dudes uh, yeah. because they don't yeah. they don't have game. They don't know how to holler uh, at the girls. Well, they don't know. Trash, and bro. then when they do holler, okay. it's usually a a a a, a they watch black dudes, well, and then it's really horrible. Here. It's like oh, you, well, yeah. it's it's like real crazy. But, and then they'll tell the girls to stay away from black dudes because we'll do it better. Bro, yeah. Go ahead. Here's the thing, bro. <laughs> what you guys are missing is like you know. What I am I missing, Vishnu? I went, to, I went to high school in 11th grade in West Virginia, bro. I was the two Indian people in the entire school. I don't have a clique. I don't have a. I don't have a, uh, you, you know, a one man army. Yeah, you can't build a game with being, you know, yeah, whereas, true, like, whereas you, you have a, a game with what? Whereas, He's a one you know, man army. It's not your army. language. It's not your, it's not your language. It's not your culture. You don't know what they're thinking about. Well, you. Let me tell you, so I'll tell you this you know, straight up. So black for dudes me, will yeah, absorb an Indian dude. In a, if a, if you're a cool Indian dude, period. Well, a cool white dude, we don't give black a fuck. dudes will we, we absorb you in. We always bring you in. And we'll have your back. But the thing is, because Rich Nubaco came to America when he was like a teenager, all his um, peers were probably taking the piss out of him because, because of the accent. Up until recently, Africans used to deal with the same thing. If you leave Nigeria or like Ghana or whatever as a teenager and you still have that accent, people are going to laugh at you. All the kids are going to laugh at you. They're going to call you freshy, fresh off the boat. Why do you have that funny accent? Well, Dudes will we, absorb we always you in. bring you in.
all the oh, time. And we'll they, have your is, back, but, too. They, they do at but the same time. But not the reverse time, all the time. At the same time. time, there is so much, you know, the, the divisiveness is... Between both the cultures has been like at, We're at least. We're talking about talking to women. You always got to go. I know because woman. when you say black woman, like you know, they they take you in, but at the same time, no, I said we said the, if the, you're black dudes yeah. and there's an Indian dude, black dudes would be the first. Oh no, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Come. Oh, I'm, I have. Black we'll be like, like that, yeah. So I'm not disputing that. Always looking. But I'm talking about the game wise. When you when you judge people saying like a lot of kids here, they grew up as one or two people in the entire school. They don't have social skills. So when they come I know to, it's like to be like you know, only black in white school. Yeah, but I like know. but like when you grow up in a in a school like when you go to a school where you are one of many, you have social skills, you have mm-hmm. interaction skills. So your judgment is fucked up like that. Well, because so I really I I, I, I get it, here. but I still think you guys are the corniest. <laughs> that's I'm not, that's, that's, that's your not, bias. That's, that's your not, bias. But except for you, Vishnu, <laughs> fuck all the mother dudes, because you're Vishnu. <laughs> <laughs> but no, so you said you were smooth. That's cool, cause like but it's not just me. I'm just talking about like as well, when you have a social like you know. There's some African dudes that be some cornballs. African dudes be. Godfrey said it, and I know that personally. Because I'm an African. The accent, when you have that accent, people are going to take the piss out of you. So I understand what Vishnu is actually saying, to be fair. Well, when there's you have a social, like, you know, there's some African a, dudes that yeah, be some cornballs. You know yeah, yeah. yeah. African dudes be cornballs too. If, that, if that's the, real shit. Yeah, if they don't, I was seeing you the other day. I saw you. I wanted to maybe <laughs> come and talk to you. <laughs> maybe we can go and eat something. I like you. are very beautiful. I want to taste your fire. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's, there's some Nigerians <laughs> no. be corny as fuck. He's like, hey, woman, come here. I want to taste your fire. I want to, <laughs> like, you are my fantasy. I've been looking. I want to taste your fire. I want to see what you have cooking in the oven. You look very nice and delicious. I want to grab hold of those fantastic melons that are... Oh, okay, let me calm down. Let me bring it. Okay, I should come here. I want to taste your fire. I want to, <laughs> uh, you are my fantasy. I've been looking at yeah. you. Hey, ah, ah. Yeah. I just want to come and... Oh, every time I see your beauty, I've been dreaming about you. I've been watching you all, the, all day, all night. I want to... I want to be able to embody you and maybe possibly taste your fire. (laughs) You must be tired because you have been running to my mind all day. (laughs) (laughs) Yes. But that was a very, very interesting interview, guys. That's very, very funny. Very, very funny. I feel like Vishnu does make a few interesting points. And it's not just Indians that deal with this sometimes. Africans deal with it too. A lot of these guys, they struggle with, you know, relationships and relationships and finding a girl and, and, and stuff like that. It's a cultural thing. It's very much a cultural thing. I did quite enjoy this, man. I did quite enjoy this. And it's good to see like a different, different races and like different, different people all on the Godfrey podcast, man. You got two, well, I, f- I believe she's Pakistanian. He's Indian. Vishnu's Indian, then of course you got um, Dante. So many different people all on one podcast. It's a beautiful thing to see, guys. Absolutely beautiful. But anyway, I feel I'm just going to leave it there. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you later.